Karen Coburn, Canada. Canada. The trampoline it girl of her generation, Canada's Karen Cockburn has done it all. A four-time Olympian, Cockburn owns three Olympic medals, more than any trampoline gymnast in history. For gymnasts like Rosanna McLennan, she was more than a teammate. She gave them something to aspire to. I watched her compete in the Sydney Games uh, for the first trampoline meet ever in the Olympics and win a medal. And that really sparked my Olympic dream and got me training really hard because it also gave me a view of what it actually takes to get there. Quebec City, 2007. Cockburn and McLennan become world champions in synchro trampoline. An unforgettable moment for Canada, which marked its first ever gold medal in women's synchro. During the next few years, Cockburn began to contemplate opening a new chapter in her life. I'd been wanting to start a family for a while and I didn't want to put that off any longer. So me and my husband had planned to, to try for a child and it worked right away. After the birth of her daughter, Emily, in 2013, Cockburn had time to think about what would come next. The lure of competition was still strong and she returned to the gym in early 2014 with a new objective. Competing in front of uh, my family and friends in Toronto, which I never had the opportunity to do before, was a huge selling point. So I just worked really hard uh, after I had my daughter Emily to, to be ready for those games, and that was an amazing experience and um, probably one of the highlights of my career, just competing at home and um, reading the athlete's oath at the opening ceremonies there um, in that huge stadium. And just, it was amazing. I have so many great memories from that competition. <laughs> It's definitely a challenge um, each day, you know, my, my daughter might wake up at four in the morning and then, you know, it's hard to train later or just, you know, she's obviously my priority, so she comes first, so um, I'll drop anything to, to be with her if she needs me, but it's definitely hard to juggle, juggle both things, um, but I just try to keep things in order, family first, then training, and then any kind of additional, like, appearances or shows or work like that, so I just try to keep my priorities straight and I'm able to balance, um, everything but it's definitely tough tough some days and um, but you know all athletes have things that they deal with whether they're parents or they have jobs or we're all juggling um, different hats so yeah. <laughs> Cockburn and McLennan couldn't resist seeing if they could both qualify for one more Olympics which for Cockburn would be her fifth. For McLennan the interest is defending her Olympic title. I try not to get ahead of myself and think too far ahead I, I think of um, the day-to-day -day and what I can do in training each day but of course it'd be amazing to have an honor of competing at a games again but um, being a four-time Olympian and already having an amazing career it just you know makes me feel confident and just happy with uh, everything so far and everything now is just kind of a bonus and um, icing on the cake I guess if I can perform and um, earn a spot again that'd be amazing. And after Rio is there any chance she'll stick around? Um, no. <laughs> no, I've, I've decided that I'll, I will retire at the end of next year and just focus on um, my family and um, other, uh, other opportunities and, and move on at that point. Um, but it's, it, it's bittersweet because it's nice to move on to new things, but I love trampoline and I'll stay involved for sure in, in some form or some way because uh, I still have a huge passion for the sport. Now,